Today we're going to be doing the cheap versus expensive swim bait fishing challenge. About four years ago we filmed a video very similar to this and I was like why not film it again and make it even better this time. So there's a little bit of twist on today's video. Fletcher is going to be fishing with a $100 swim bait and it's also a very large swim bait. The $15 swim bait that I'm going to be fishing with is a lot smaller. So not only are we going to be comparing if the more expensive one's gonna catch more fish than the cheaper or inexpensive swim bait, we're gonna be comparing the size with big versus small. So if you guys wanna see some more videos like this, hit the like button, let me know in the comment section down below. Also hit the subscribe button if you guys haven't already, it really helps out the channel. And share this video with a friend, get somebody new in the fishing, I'd really appreciate that. But let's go ahead and hop into it, talk a little bit about the swim baits, and then try to catch some big fish. Let's get it, baby. Before we hop into this video and talk about the swim baits we're gonna be using, I actually have three of the brand new mock shads by mock baits that i'm going to be giving away these are actually the ones that i'm going to be fishing with today in the video but if you guys want to enter this giveaway all you have to do is be subscribed to the channel hit the like button on today's video hit the notification bell next to the subscribe button and comment down below what your favorite swim bait is let me know what your favorite swim bait of all time is or if you don't swim bait fish much comment down below on some videos you guys want to see in the upcoming videos if you do all those steps you'll be entered to win these baits let's go ahead and show y'all the crazy bait that fletcher's fishing with this is a really cool swim bait it's super similar to what noah's throwing but just like five times the size and this is like a uh, i believe it's like a 3d printed shad and this has like a nice slow fall on it nice and controlled it could be perfect for this pond and we've already seen quite a few fish swimming around so i think there's a good chance that uh, a big one's going to be coming for this you better watch out before i go in depth on the baits that i'm throwing today and tying them on i would like to say that we're going to do a little competition today so what he what he's trying to say is he's gonna lose today i might lose so <laughs> let me tell you why so when it comes to big baits what do you assume you're gonna big catch fish. a bigger fish right big fish okay so our goal today is we're going to weigh our biggest three a piece the thing today is will a bigger swim bait catch and produce bigger fish. bigger fish than a smaller swim bait so we're going to find out today see what my best three weighs, see what his best three weighs, and then compare the weights at the end realistically i would think that a bigger swim bait would catch bigger fish but then again I don't know, man. I don't know. I we're going to have to let the fish decide. Yeah, we're going to have to let the fish decide, <laughs> hop right into it. Let's go ahead and get on the boat. I'm going to tie my bait on, and we're going to go catch some fish today, guys. We haven't been to this little pond in a very long time, so we don't really know what to expect, but yeah. we've had a lot of good luck swim bait fishing this pond in the past, and I think it's going to be good. Let's go ahead and hop into it, baby. Don't fall in, Fletchy. Um, yeah, I'm going to do my best. I got a $7,000 camera. <laughs> Oh, all right, we're good. <laughs> I'm ready to get today started, guys. I'm excited about it. One, because I really love swim bait fishing. And two, I haven't filmed a cheap versus expensive challenge in a while. Let me know down below, too, if you want to see some more cheap versus expensive ones. If you have anything in mind or even baits that we should put put head to head. Um, I think that would be really cool. <laughs> okay, I was, I was thinking about telling you mid like thrust, but there is no stopping myself there. Wouldn't that have been a way to start the video? We would have both fell in the water. That would have been great. So I got three different colors in the new mock chat. By the way, these should be getting distri distributed throughout all the Dick Sporting Goods actually this week. So if you guys want to go check them out, Dick Sporting Goods. It's a sweet little swim bait here. We're going to put it to the test today. First time on video. I've fished with it many a times before, but not on video yet. So I'm excited about this just to show you guys and really see if we can catch some really big ones on it today and we've seen a bunch of big fish swimming uh the fishing this week hasn't been the best but i have high hopes in today i, I really I'm i feel thinking, it dude. i think we can get it done yeah i think we're gonna get it done today so we have three different colors and i think for the start i'm gonna end up using this white one just because fletcher's swim bait over here that we're putting it against is white so it only makes the most sense that we use this if you're wondering about the exact color it's pearl or orange belly and it's a beautiful pearl color, dude. That thing looks saucy. Like. If you guys are wondering what rod I'm using, this is the Kicking Their Bass X Lose combo. It's available in right hand bait caster, left hand, and spinning combo. It's only available on my website, kickingtheirbass.com. Everybody who supports me and supports the brand, I really appreciate it. But go ahead and head to the link down below. I'll pop it up on the screen as well. 
and copy one of these bad boys and if you guys get some pictures in it i'd love to see that send them to me on instagram tag me yeah that was a good fish right oh, there he's on that bed, but we're just gonna get after it guys we got we got some fish to catch today i think he's on that bed right there oh what the heck well so much for a hundred dollar swim bait are you serious the tail snapped off are you serious where did it go i don't know i have no i have literally no idea it's not like i hit it on anything but the water so i tried to throw this the first cast with this thing the tail snapped off the back which is I don't, I don't even know what to think about that considering this is an expensive swim bait it does kind of work still we might end up switching to a different bigger size swim bait but we're gonna give it a shot with uh the micro of course, tail of course that would have happened <laughs> yeah, right at the beginning right it's still swimming it's still swimming hey it might it might help you out who knows it's a little yeah. smaller profile now <laughs> all right test our drag i think we're good let's get to work it's not small enough to where you can't really cast it either. I can still get it out there pretty good. Dude, this water's so clear in here, Fletcher. We're probably gonna see a majority of our bites. I know. Oh, dude. I got one already, oh, dude. It's a good dang. one too, man. Are you serious? Dang. No way. I can't tell how big he is. He looks like he's two, two and a half. Oh, yeah. Was well, that like your third cast? Dude, literally, I just put it on. Yeah, that sucker that? good too, bro. Was he up there in the, in the shade? Yeah, he was. Yeah, he was. I cannot believe that, bro. That was instant. Like, literally instant on the new mock shot. <laughs> that is sweet. Do you get him on the pause? I got him pinned pretty good too. You... Um, yeah, I think I paused it. Right when I paused it is when he dove over it. I watched him eat it, though. The first fish today and first fish. On the mock shad on video. Oh, oh you hooked that pile. I got the tree. Oh no, you Gosh, shouldn't. Gosh, it felt like a fish. All right, dude, I know this fish isn't that big, but I do think I should weigh it. what did you say, you wanna take a little guess? I'd say two, one. Yeah, I'm gonna say two, three. Two, four, five. Wow, she's, she's a little heftier. Yeah, a little girth. Well, there we go, guys. First fish of the video and first fish on the small swim bait. That was so quick. I didn't expect to get bit that quick. That's a two, four, five. We got two and a half pounds on the scale, baby. Let's get it. Fletcher's over here with a, about a 500 pound tree. Yeah. We're gonna yeah, go get you undone. By, uh, All right, 2.45 for my first fish. You get it? Yeah. Dude, the hole up there is oh, Fletcher. Dude, next oh, cast, I'm about to get one. Look at this, God. look at that. Look at him chasing it. Oh, oh my God. Oh, oh see him. Dude, throw your bait in there. Why well, even see the other fish? I know, he came out of nowhere, bro, oh, and stole God. his bait. Bro, what is up with this swim bait, bro? Oh my goodness. I've used this thing off camera, guys, and I caught some good fish on it, but not like this. Like that, bro, they're smoking this thing. Look at that, bro. Oh, look, look at that, bro. Well, is this right? The swim bait is getting smoked. <laughs> that is the advantage I think the big swim bait has is a lot of these smaller ones, I don't think would go for it. You know what I mean? Yeah. You are missing a tail. If you have to here later on in the video, we might have to get you with something else. I think you should get a hole up there. These hooks are so sticky too. Like these bass are not coming off, dude. Look at that. Another, I'd say about a two pounder. So we had, I had this one following it guys off that dock. And then all of a sudden this one came up and just straight up stole it from him. Just annihilated it. Straight up annihilated that thing. It's a 203. Oh, really? <laughs> or 201. There you go. <laughs> what I guess for the last fish? Oh, but I got Fowler. 201, did you? Yeah, he's right here. Oh, dude, that's a nice one. That, oh, gosh. Get him, Fletcher. Come on, Fletch. I believe in you. I know we're going against each other today, but <laughs> I still want... The people want this, dude. All right, I got a 245 and a 2.01. hammered yep gosh dude they are tackling this thing fletcher like i gosh. i honestly feel bad like <laughs> i'm not even gonna weigh this one this is a pounder but they're just dude they're it's not even like they're barely eating it too they're just tackling this thing super aggressive I'm sorry buddy I'm, you got it out yourself yeah i'm not even gonna weigh that one but 
That was a cool bite. Oh my god, oh, guys, this is something else. If you guys are wondering how I'm working it, I'll demonstrate it here. I'm just throwing the swim bait out there. I'm, I'm working it very aggressive. I didn't know how I was gonna have to work it today, but I'm, I'm giving it like some really fast reels. That thing's jittering across the top. I'm keeping it about six inches below the surface and I'm stopping it. So I'm giving it these really hard rips and this thing's swimming through the water so quick. And usually right when I pause it is when that fish is coming up and, and hitting it. So I'm reeling it, pause, reeling it, pause. That seems to be what's triggering these bass to hit it. We're able to work it a little aggressive today. You know, we had a cold front at the beginning of this week and we fished the other day, it was a little tough. We, it was hard for us to get the bites or, or just to have the fish hold on to the, to the bait. But today seems to be a different story. They seem to be biting a lot better. I'm like just fan casting. Look at those two right there in front of me. You want to throw on those? Three right there. Oh, dude, I just got eaten. Yeah, I just got smoked off of that bed. You're not that big. <laughs> Ready to have some fun. <laughs> Alright, I'm perfectly fine with that. Dude, there is. I, I, don't, I can't get them off of this thing, bro. It's so calm today. It is, dude. You can see everything. Do you care if I switch to uh, an S waiver? Yeah, you can. Okay. Only because of your tail. <laughs> yeah, I, feel like, I feel like I owe you. <laughs> yeah. To, to, to We're not, a little handicapped yeah, here. You, you need something. Yeah. You want to go over here and then work our way? That's I cool. just feel like that S waiver underneath. Oh, dude, there's a huge one underneath. Oh, me. my. Look at that, bro. Gosh. You just find me. That was like a four pounder, dude. Jeez Louise. Dude, they just wow. come out of nowhere. Dude, I don't know what it is with this little thing, bro. This might be the bait of choice today. Oh my god, I got a huge one. Dude, that's a big oh. one, bro. I watched him eat it. Alright, I'm ready to get in. Dude, I'm here. I'm oh. thinking. <laughs> I can't believe it, dude. I watched the I watched this fish come 10 foot from the left. He's not even that big, he's just long. I thought he was a lot bigger than he is. There we go, guys. This is my, it's gonna be part of my three bass limit. Caught more, but two or five. Not bad. I got a little average of two pounders. I caught one, two and a half, and then a couple two two pounders. Got the S waiver tied on. This is definitely a smaller bait by all means, and this one suspends a lot better than the one that I was using, but mainly the tail on that thing fell off, which caused it to lose a lot of action, which didn't give me a whole lot of confidence in throwing it. I would love to continue so, but I think the better option is gonna be this S waiver for now, especially the way it just suspends really nice when you pause it. It seems like Noah's been getting most of his bites on that pause, so. A few pauses with this, this thing should get crushed. I know. All those beds just look so good. And you saw that big one, you know, these big ones might be out off the bank, you know. Oh, oh, oh I saw just that. like that, bro. Oh, no, you bro, he still... bro, I can't get him off of it. I paused it, bro. I can't get him off this bait. I've never in my life, dude. Is that the same one that tore? That oh, that is a good one. That is probably my biggest. Fletcher, what is happening here, bro? You almost had one too. All I know is you got the juice. Uh, this is the juice, dude. I, I knew this bait was gonna catch him pretty good, but I did not think like this, bro. Like, this is not even right. It's not even right. I'm more impressed with how these hooks are freaking sticking them so good, man. I don't think you missed one yet. So they have amazing hooks on the baits, and that's one of the great things about the mock bait selection is overall hooks and how sticky they are but they're like overall like really holding these fish well oh i need to weigh this one bro that's definitely that's my biggest one bro over two and a half 2.6 is my guess yeah 2.5 not bad 2.56 all right all right fletcher so 2.05 2.56. So I got a 2.45, a 2.05, and a 2.56. Fletcher could catch one fish on that swim bait though and knock mine out. So I can be, I can have as much confidence as I want in the world right now, but still know that that big one that he's throwing could 
pull up a giant any yeah. minute. You know? <laughs> and you got you got swiped a second ago before I caught that one. I was really paying attention to you, dude. And I looked down and I saw him dive over my bait again. I'm like, every time I look up, there's a fish going after that thing. <laughs> I mean, it's ridiculous. <laughs> I'm gonna have to let you throw it here towards the end. Like, I'm not even kidding. Man, this thing, <laughs> it's not even fair, bro. I feel kind of bad. I thought it was. I don't know. I didn't expect to fishing on easy mode. Right I, I didn't now. expect to be fishing with a magnet. Oh, gosh. he slammed you. I said that hook way too hard. I mean, there's so many beds. The crazy thing is, is if this was a dirty water pond, what? Dude, I can't get them off of it, bro. I, I, Fletcher. <laughs> Every two to three castle of that thing, you're getting smoked. It's not even like a. I don't even know what to say, bro. Look at how they're eating it, too. Golly. Yeah, this is not going to coal. I don't know. All these fish are... This one's only a pound. Don't lose confidence, Fletcher. Paired my one bite. 0. 0.75, 0. 0.9, and 1.1. <laughs> I hate to break it to you, but there's another one trying to eat me. <laughs> God dang, dude. <laughs> I do. Listen, I want to be real, bro. Life. Like, we've had good days in this pond, but... I don't, I don't know if it's the bait or if it's just they're biting. Clearly, it's the bait. Yeah, it's got to be the bait. Yeah. Oh my God, bro! Look at that big one on me. You want to try to catch it? Throw it in there. That's, just... that's nice of you, man. Thanks. <laughs> Thanks. I appreciate it. I don't know what to say, bro. Oh God! <laughs> that thing is insane. Dude, I don't even know what to say. You want to switch for a minute? I don't need. I don't need it. I don't need it. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what's happening, bro. I might get a tattoo of this bait on my arm if I have, <laughs> if I happen to catch another five fish. I mean, I haven't been this like crazy over something since the pop and pickle. <laughs> The pot and pickle was like this too, bro. It was like one of those baits I was just like, I don't understand. Like, why is it so good? Yeah, like, why is it just doing it? I mean, obviously I love like a rage car or something, but nothing that's just like, I've been like so confused on more of like than anything. It turned off on us. Oh, yeah. oh, that's just caught them all, dude. He caught every fish in the pond, man. Bump something. I didn't really feel like a bite, but I guess dude, it really was a magnet, bro. I just caught every one in a matter of a couple minutes. And now it's done. <laughs> oh, there's one. Fine. Oh my gosh. Dang. Uh, yeah, I just got one on like a bigger swim bait. And he got off. He was probably like three. That corner is usually absolutely absurd. Oh god. And I'm on the tree. I cast him there before I Oh! Oh my gosh! No Shut way! Up. Dude, he's, he's still on! He's, Shut up! Oh my god! I was, I was stuck on the I was stuck on that stick and that fish just came up and crushed it. What actually just happened? How did you actually get him hooked? I don't know. Of all the all the fish, I get hooked at Bro, that. That was probably the craziest bite. That was. He's literally still on there. Yeah, he's still on there. Oh, he's off. He's off. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. Awesome. Yes, that was insane, guys. I was stuck on that stick, and that fish just came up out of the water and annihilated and just ripped it off of the stick for me. You had to. Have been <laughs> The new pattern's just to, to get this thing hooked on something. Hey, that scale, it's my turn to weigh a fish. You've had enough. You've, you've weighed enough. Let me see him. What you thinking? Two, two and three quarters. Two and three quarters? You think this is the biggest one so far? I think it's a 263, actually. 263, oddly specific. I'm going to say uh, a 274. Oh, God. Oh, 2.4. Not, not as girthy as I thought, but I'll take it. I'll take it. Crazy. I'll take more bites like that all day. Here we go. I got the biggest one. Nice, dude. That's the bad dude. I'm telling you, we got a blast. Right off the stick. 
Yeah, that's what we need. I think that's gonna cold out one one. He came right over that branch, dude. Maybe that is the case, Fletcher. Fletcher figured out the stick, the stick trend over here. Golly, dude, this was strong. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think that might be my 201. Definitely, right? Yeah, I think 201's my smallest one. Yes, yeah, so a 201, a 205, and then like a 256. Yeah. 218. 218, gonna call out the 201. So, or 205 is my smallest. What was mine? Can you put mine in? It was a 2.4 something. I think it was 2.46. Call it. All right, so I got a 2.45, a 2.18, and a 2.56. I watched him eat it. Probably the most quiet nose I've ever been on a <laughs> cast to catch, but enjoy the ASMR. Whoa! Oh yeah! I don't know what's really happened in the last 30 minutes, but these fish. I'm... That looks like a decent one. Yeah. <laughs> As always, when you start to talk yeah. about it. Second... Didn't that happen to us yesterday? Yeah, yeah you were like throwing that swim bait for like an hour. Oh my gosh. Yeah. I don't think it's gonna help help the case. It might. Is that? Oh no, he's a little chunky, dude. Yeah, but that one's got some. He, got some he might be 205. That's that's what I think I gotta be. Still getting them, calling them out. These fish. What I was going to is. These fish just haven't been biting how they were. All right, y'all. Let's get this guy on the scale. If he can beat 105 or 205. Oh my gosh, my biggest one yet. 271. Dang. Okay. He's a thick. He was the thick body. Look, thick. look at him. See how thick he is? Yeah. Two seven. Did I say two seven one? Yeah. Gosh, I needed that. That was a fish I needed. I almost didn't weigh him, dude. But then I was like, wait, he's thicker than a snicker, dude. All of my fish are over two and a half except for one. It's a two four six. Oh, there we go. There we go. Gosh, he hammered it. Gosh, dang it. It's those hooks, ain't it? These are the worst hooks. I'm, I'm convinced. Like I've gotten the bites, like since I put this on. Oh, I just got hit instantly. Whoa, there we go. They're back. Gosh, these are the worst hooks. Bro. These are the worst hooks. Bro. Bro, you went for not getting any bites to back-to-back cast, just smoking one. Dang, bro. All right, watch you do it again. They're eating that it. Was your... <gasps> God, dude. They're eating it, dude. What is going on? I guess I spoke too soon. I was about to tell. Oh my. Why are they nip? Eat it. Eat it. That's a good one. Too. Eat it. God, dude, so they good. won't. They won't eat it. They just both. They pecked it again. He pecked it again. He pecked it three times. Eat it, say, you son it. of a biscuit. I think that's what might be triggering my bites is being able to reel it really fast. That big one that you got, I don't know if it's the $100 one. Yeah. It might be worth trying it because what I'm noticing is when I slow it down is when- Oh my gosh. Eat it, there we go. Thank gosh, dude. Yeah, finally got a second fish. I got two bites there. The one came up and nipped it and this guy got jealous so he hammered it when that other one backed off. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so how's your tournament going? <laughs> it's going great. It's going really good. <laughs> Throw down that bank. I'll let you have that one. God dog. Dude. We're gonna call that one two pounds. All right. I got my hands on him. Oh, I just got tanked. Must be nice. <laughs> Oh my goodness. I don't think he's a he's a help. He definitely isn't. He's a little skinny body bass. But I'll take him. He's still about two. 
I don't know if he is and he's a high one pound. But you're still smoking it. Butcher's been getting a lot of fish on his, but they did not commit. And these fish are just acting weird today. So many followers today, man. It's just we gotta call all the bass that we've seen. I mean, God, God, bro, it's insane the way that they're hitting it. I mean, I missed them. Is that the same fish? Or yeah, it's the same. I don't know. It could have been a different one, but I think it's the same. If he is a different one, he's about the same size. Probably about a two pounder, guys. I'm not even gonna weigh him. I, I gotta have a fish two and a half plus, or two four six plus. But right there, guys, I just threw in there and freaking. What I do is I, I'm reeling it really aggressive. I don't know if you guys have been watching, you know, kind of how the techniques change slightly. I throw it up there and I, I burn it and then I just kill it and I burn it again and I kill it. And that's what's really been triggering those fish to bite. It's been that fast pace. It's kind of triggered a reaction bite. You know, the bass kind of go crazy on it. I tied on another big-ish swim bait and this one is a bluegill color. This one actually floats. So you fish it a little bit differently. I'm interested to see how they react to that float mechanic that this thing has. It kind of comes up not super fast, but definitely with a little bit of speed. There you go, smoke on that. You can work that a little faster. And it's got some stickier hooks. I don't lose it to the. Oh gosh, dude! Dude, that's like a good one. Too. Gosh, man. Well, looks like that was a good move. <laughs> Stick to your hooks, and what do you know? That this fish was this, my bait was stuck in the tree again. They don't call me Professor Dangle for no reason. All right. Oh, it took my hook off. The uh, what is going on? Can I? <laughs> <laughs> Can I not win today? My split ring broke. Man, these, these expensive swim baits suck. Gosh. <laughs> Buy you a mock bait, man. <laughs> clearly, clearly, no one else knows how Dude, to make a bait. We have tried everything for you to be able to fish with expensive swim baits today, but it's just like trying to make you not do it. Pound and seven something. 1.52. We'll take it. You know what? Well, we'll take it. So we got a 2, a 2.4, and a 1.5. And now we got a swim bait with one hook. Bro, that would be funny. <laughs> I just think that it sinks too fast. That's my only thing. And it's kind of, I can't really get it to do its action unless I reel it with a little bit of speed. Oh yeah, he's pissed, dude. Keeps keeps popping it. Oh, got him! Got him! Yeah, I got the smaller one. I got the smaller one. <laughs> Let's go! <laughs> we got one on the big swim bait. Even though we had technical difficulties, give me give me them pliers, boy. Still made it happen, dude. We are struggling. We are struggling bad. One one point two eight. Let's go. Come on, Noah. So does that call out your virtual two pounder? <laughs> that calls out my, vir <laughs> my virtual two pounder. <laughs> yeah. I never would think to put a two ounce swim bait on the dang bed. <laughs> oh, dude, that sucker hammered it. That one came out of nowhere to see that. was It's so crazy because some of these bass are so picky, and then you'll have some just come out and just demolish it. Well, all right, y'all, we just got off the water and wow, that was a crazy day of fishing right there. Fletcher ended up getting one on that really big swim bait, $100 custom one. I got to uh, like duck down to get in here, dude. I know, dude. What's up, man? That was like 411. Dude, I'm 4'2", bro. <laughs> like, at least get it right. No, we had a good time out there today. Unfortunately, that big swim bait happened to break its tail. It broke its tail. Um, and then we tried some other swim baits and that one broke too. So. so when it came down to it, that mock shad, that thing was smoking. Unmatched, them. Like, unmatched, <laughs> unmatched. Like that was like, honestly insane. And going into this, like I was like, yeah, I'm gonna catch some good fish on it. Like, I don't know. I, I didn't think I was gonna slay them like I did. And it, it was just insane. I didn't have any problems with it. The hooks were really good. Um, and caught a ton of fish overall. They were smoking that thing. Crazy, but ended up getting the dub over the big swim baits. And I, I know. know you had those difficulties with it, but even the S waiver. <laughs> yeah. 
like even they, the S waiver, dude. And they, that's a good swim bait. And like they just weren't. They just weren't going for They're it. They're that smaller swim bait action today. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video where we do the cheap versus expensive and also the big versus small in the same episode. If you did, make sure you hit the like button on this video. Drop a comment down below on which one you want to see us film next, and we'll make sure to pop it out for y'all. And subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Check out Fletcher's channel down below. And I will catch y'all in the next episode.